Oh. <sighs> well, at least it's not raining. Special occasions, and that's why I'm never invited to them. You pay me now? It's your spine, dude. It got, like, yanked up a bunch of notches. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. This one will do nicely. <laughs> Well, this is nothing. Probably just a random act of violence. Look out your window. You see that Anheuser Busch billboard next to the children's hospital? Well, watch this. And now, back to Two and a Half Men. Ah! Hey, nice Snoopy costume, Brian. Thanks. You're watching CBS, the loudest channel on TV. You fat, so punch your baby in the face. I guess you win. I'm still hungry, said the very hungry caterpillar, but you've already... Gosh! Okay, into the eternal pit of fire you go. But I don't remember how long I said it. 18th century society. Hi, Dad. You're a poop nose. I'm invincible! Sir, shoot me if you must, but it is imperative that I look at these pictures. I smell gas! Bet that thing's not even loaded. Okay, go! Hey, bruh? Yeah? Trick or treat for UNICEF? Happy Thanksgiving, everyone. Taxi! Oh! Excuse me, do you know if Costco has any of those Tommy Bahama beach chairs left? Yeah. Hmm. Dad, you're reading the paper upside down. Wrong. Oh, for the love of penis. Well, watch out. We got some bad roaches here. What are your plans for cleaning up our environment? 9-11. Hey, I'm riding that roller coaster, and that's all there is to it. Now, let's get out of here. This thing's squishing my organs around. Looks like the operation was a success. Just all be grateful that things are completely back to normal again. For a look at how locals are dealing with the imminent disaster. Trisha? Diane, I'm here. Huh. Maybe that explains what happened with that new guy at work today. All right, so this is... Oh, excuse me. I believe I was next. Uh, step aside, lady. One, two, three. Oh, for God's sake, why? This- Meg, could you come here, please? Come on. Oh, sorry, Chris, I can't. I got insanity practice. Ah! Why do you hate that show so much? Because it's prevent- It's actually, it's kind of a funny story. And I'm ballers! Now, I don't want to pat myself on the back, but I worked all day getting them just right. Holy c- I was wondering if- If, if you dare- do me the honor of, uh... Here it is, a penny from 1858. We're getting closer to our answer. You think you could do that? Sure, all we gotta do is get you a little fixed up. You know, get your hair cut, give you good clean... Uh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> well, thank oh my god, Brian. You're 1% cat. And part black. What? Peter, come on, walk over here. Peter, are you ready for your Valentine's gift? How you doing, Doc? Yeah. So you got a tank, big whoop. Want to fight about it? Relax, Quagmire. You're doing better than Peter Weller from the opening scene of RoboCop. Chris, the way to eat an Oreo is to twist it. Pull it apart and lick it. Now you. Captain America, can I see your shield for a second? Sure, here you go. And you soon will be dead. What's all that noise? Oh, do you want a hug from your big sister? He's not feeling well. Fuck you. 
It's Foon from the word before. I don't see what. <laughs> it's perfect. Yes, this will really tell people. Now, Brian, I don't watch mafia movies, but I did see Fargo. Huh? God damn! I know, right? <laughs> Just gonna watch her die on her own. Anyone? Anyone? All by you. <laughs> Up here, there's free food, a bar, and you can drop a plastic spider on a string on your friends below. Really? Go, Kohan! Pull over here, I gotta take a leak. Hey, Tricia, as a local resident, I feel like I can once again take pride in my community. I think this is really gonna revitalize tourism and... <laughs> Bingo, bitches! We have to bring him back to life. What? Are you serious? It's the only thing that'll snap him out of it. Well, maybe, but what if I try it with a basketball? Oh, wait! We've dreamed. Oh, I do hope so. I've always imagined the most beautiful... ...in time. You want to make $200? I do. <laughs> Brian? Lock door. Why would I... I ...need is one incriminating entry in the state book, and that's our ticket to... I brought crystal meth. I brought ten rounds of chemotherapy. This is O.J. Simpson's Heisman Trophy. Are you crazy? You shouldn't claim to have that. Relax, it's fine. What are the chances he tries to steal it back twice? Oh, stag nab. That's some poker face you've got, Peter. Got it? We're gonna be okay. <laughs> Lois's heart grew three sizes that day. Brady, you're the one who's going down, Griffin. No way. In fact, I'm standing. Uh, hang on, he's still getting ready. Two, one. Some animals give me boners. Oh, probably. Probably, right? Well, was you in the bathroom? Uh. Scotch tape? Ed, now that you're retired, you're coming to stay with us. No more excuses. I'm putting my foot down. That must be the new nanny. Is this the Griffin house? To put you out of your misery. Let me just dunk the turkey once. I know I can jam it. I need a nap. Brian, turn on the heat and NPR. Brian, knock knock. Who's there? <laughs> hey, Cleveland, come on in. The police are gone? Oh my god, we're finally safe! Ellie the N-word. so they can be pretty stuffy and judgmental. Well, you. Doc, give it to us straight. What's going on with our friend? Well, Mr. Griffin, there's no easy way to put this, so I'm just going to come right out and say it. He's black. This gives me an idea. She's dead. Uh, yeah, it's the world. I'm a dog. I'm good. Probably with the receipt. <sighs> Manager who's dishearteningly younger than me to the service counter, please. This girls? What do these do? Meatloaf, Mom! Thanks, honey. Hungry! Hung! We look hot! Totally hot! Ugly bitches! This tyranny shall not stand, for without liberty... Well then... Hey, what do you say we go home, eh? Sounds good to me. Oh my god, that was so much fun! You know, boys, we just might make this our regular spot. 
baseball asked you to jump off a building, would you do that too? Did it? No, I'm just using that as an example of- I Listen to the- Well, Lois? Oh no, Peter, quick, change pigments! <laughs> I'm planning on dying tonight! thought maybe your father would show up at the last second and we'd have one of those airport scenes. Well, that's a nice movie trope, Lois, but the post-9-11 reality is there's no way a non-ticketed civilian can... Believe! What? Believe everything everyone tells me anywhere. They'll suck a railroad spike. I haven't got any money. Well, then I'm afraid I'm going to have to take it away from you. <laughs> Thing he says is a stitch. I have it. <laughs> oh, Stature, if I were big, oh, just think where I would be. Man, Texas is great. Back where I'm from, a retarded guy could never have this much fun. Would you just say? What? Technically, I'm retarded. Peter, why would they make you president? Well, maybe it's because I can recite all 50 states in a quarter of a second. All right, even though we just walked in and this whole place is one hallway, let's consult the map. Okay. Uh-oh. Guarded electronics end up in the ocean and kill sea turtles? Well then, let's cut out the middleman. Um, yes, quite an ordeal for Cohog's Peter Griffin. So, Mr. Griffin, you were going around in circles for 12 hours. Are you suffering any ill effects from the centrifugal force? When young kids act out, what they're really doing is asking to be heard. They have very little control in their lives, so the key, and I mean key... You've never been in the same state. How do you respond to that? Would anyone like to try my gingbok? Why don't I get you seated in the dining room and then we'll pour the wine? Uh, I just bought it yesterday. Isn't it beautiful? Cripple, cripple, cripple. The video I always enjoyed was the one with that girl pooping in the jacuzzi. So let's all get in Joe's hot tub while he does the filming and I do the pooping. <sighs> okay. Okay. Okay, here it comes. Man, Texas is great. Back where I'm from, a retarded guy could never have this much fun. Would you just say? What? Technically, I'm retarded. How can you stand watching this? It's Drek and you know it. Oh, don't have the guts to respond, huh? No intelligent defense of this unmitigated crap? Commercial! Wow, I guess just call me Cupid, huh? <laughs> You're welcome. It's not I had this crazy dream I was eating a sheep and now my pillow's gone. Oh wait, here it is. What the hell was I eating? Peter, come on, walk over here. Among us. Among us. I have just one question for you. What are the... Someone was back there banging on a trash can. We just couldn't figure out who. Several players were interviewed by the league, but none would reveal... Okay. Okay, it's time to turn away now, Vince. Come on, we got a lot of song left. Turn away. Look at something else. Hey, what's that in there? That's a sensory deprivation room that prepares our astronauts for the terrifying emptiness of space. Oh, cool. Hey, come on, Brian. Try it with me. When I grow up, I want to stick my head through a circle at the beginning of movies and roar. <laughs> that. Everyone knows that life after being famous is even better than it was before. Let me just grab my stuff off the bus. Hey guys, check it out. I peed my name in the snow. Peter, what the hell is that? It's a sp me, I'll just go retrieve my hat. <sighs> Can this day get any more stressful? Ah. Oh, that's terrible. Well, we're going to have to use some cortisone on that. Oh, yeah! 
Well, I'm off to buy imaginary groceries. Brian. Hey, is your refrigerator running? Yes, it is. Are your doors unlocked? You, what? Why? You totally flip them off. Oh, hang on a sec. Some fat flip me off. Hey, up yours, you jerk. Hang on, Quagmire. I gotta kick this guy's ass. Yeah, I gotta kick this guy's ass. Hey, I'll call you back after the fight. Yeah, me too. Good luck in yours. Good luck in yours. Oh, my God. My husband's having a heart attack. Is anyone here a doctor? I have a 13... <laughs> Number 3287. Come on, Peter, I'm here to take you home. I don't know, Brian. This is the only world I know anymore. Peter, you've been in there for 15 minutes. What, what do we got brewing in here? I was walking by when I picked up the smell of 11 herbs and spice. We have to bring him back to life. Why, are you serious? It's the only thing that'll snap him out of it. Well, maybe, but what if I try it with a basketball? Oh, wait a Mi amor! We now return to the Orville on Fox. Kida, where are you? You will wash your hands after you poop. Shh, shh. Eh. It's all a bunch of shit. It's all a bunch of goddamn shit. Okay, take it easy, man. No, fuck you. I think that belongs to me. <laughs> huh? Guess it's up for the family. Even if I have to shoot our dinner. And I've missed so much. I wouldn't be standing here right now if it wasn't for you. Thought she didn't catch the kid I hired to replace Chris. Peter, what are you doing? You just ate a year's worth of food. Yeah, what a waste of money. I'm still hungry. <laughs> See, Brian? I feel great. And thank God everything's back to normal. Well, this isn't quite right, is it? Oh, uh, Grandpa always makes me so nervous when I'm driving. Here it is, guys. What do you think? <laughs> we gotta find out where that party is and get Meg out of there. Yeah, you're right. God, what happened? It seems like just yesterday she was born. Mr. Griffin, would you like to cut the cord? Sure. Okay, that wasn't the cord, and now you've got a girl. Hey, Dad! Go to your room. Okay! Spirit Airlines is now boarding group whatever. Just start punching until you're on an airplane. Wait, did we check that she can get dunked on by her dad? Dunked on by my dad? Need these shipping reports filled out by 5 o'clock today. But, but what about this farm? And this house? And the lab inside the house, which is currently producing an incredibly volatile and explosive batch of thermoreactive... What was all that noise in your bedroom this morning? Oh, you know, not much. What the fuck? <laughs> Kill yourself! Really? Ask <laughs> it! In your tail. I can't help it. Do something. To my attention that there is a Chinese among us. Rest assured, he will be found. Security is launching a full-scale investigation into the genealogy records of every single one of our employees. This man will be there. What? Where? Well, I can't tell if it's him. I, I, I think he's wearing some kind of disguise. is terrible. What do you think about this, Peter? Uh... Wow! Neil Armstrong! Hey, wait a minute. You're supposed to be on the moon. I just saw it on TV. Oh, there's a, uh, yeah, no, a tape delay and, uh, with all, uh, solar winds.
Right. I have to walk down these stairs. The one day I wore heels.